YouTube and welcome back to the JJW Sports Talk Show where every fan is welcome. Today we're going to be talking about Matt Ryan ripping the Colts offense during OTAs, taking lead, taking charge, not even more than two months into being a Colts player, to being the Colts quarterback. He's taking the lead, he's being a leader, and that's what you love to see from a quarterback coming from a different team, coming to another one to compete for a championship ring. So I'd like to so thank you for tuning in to the JJW Sports Talk Show where every fan is welcome. If you enjoy Colts content and NFL content, make sure you like, subscribe, put the post notification bell on for any future videos. Let's get back into it. So, Matt Ryan, man, you know, we always knew he was a great leader. Always knew he was very talented. And to see him come to your team and really show it and really put the offense to the test, really, you know, try to get everyone to their best, you know, the best that they can, that's important. That is big time. His character is great. His presence in the locker room is amazing. And, and on the field, he's fiery. You want that fire from a quarterback. You know, we haven't had that last year. Carson Wentz was a complete opposite. He was like, all right, man, next time. All right, man, get this. All right, man, no, we'll worry about it next time. No, Matt Ryan correcting it now. He fixes it then. He yells at them then. He doesn't wait. He doesn't, you know, he makes sure that they know they're doing wrong. He makes sure to help them and, you know, to show that he is a leader and he's taking charge of the offense. Carson Wentz did not do that. Carson Wentz was, you know, he's just not a leader like Matt Ryan, like some of these other quarterbacks. And then you also look at some, you know, like Philip Rivers two years ago. You remember how technically sound this Colts team was compared to last year? This Colts team was the most technically sound team with Philip Rivers. One of the most technically sound. Maybe not the, but one of the most. With Matt Ryan, they had the potential to be the most technically sound again. And with Matt Ryan having more arm than Phillip Rivers, could run a little more than Phillip Rivers. No, nothing crazy, but he could run to get out to get out of pressure quick. And just throw on the run. He's, he he throws pretty well in the run as well. He's consistent. You know what you're getting every single game. You know what you're getting every play, every drive. It's not just gonna be score two drives, then don't score the rest of the game. Score two drives, don't score. You know you know the next four drives. Score big time in the first half. Don't score the second half. And vice versa. Matt Ryan's going to be consistent. He is consistent as they come. Matt Ryan gives us a really good chance to take the AFC South crown, the division crown, and ultimately be a top fourth seed. Now, Titans are going to be tough. Texans are going to be sneaky. Jaguars still have a little ways to go. Nonetheless, this division is, you know, not the greatest of divisions. So the Colts have to take advantage. They have to, have to, have to take that division crown this year. They need it. They need it. So I thank you guys for tuning in to the JDW Sports Talk Show where every fan is welcome. Thank you for giving me your time. And I hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe, put the post notification bell on so you don't miss any future videos. I'll catch you all next time. This is JDW.